Yo, what is up? We got another Stalker 2 performance mod, and this one just works a lot better. And so I wanted to show it off for you guys. So right now it's called the uh, Stalker 2 Anti-Stutter Mod and Massive FPS Boost. Uh, the pictures up here show some pretty dramatic results. Mine weren't quite that good, but they are definitely better than the last mod that uh, I've been showing and using. So if you want to go ahead and just download it yourself, uh, that's the name of it. But I'll show you right now. This is without the mod, getting 60 FPS. It's actually not... Too great 40s seeing some 40s when i get into the base here uh places like this are always a little bit harder to run getting 40 high 40s 50s uh, when i'm not in the base just out in the wild it, it goes around 50. i even saw 70 earlier so i think depending on the time of day the weather all that that is just how the game runs for me with my settings sort of optimized uh so it's not great like not even really 60 most of the time and now I'm going to show you with the mod if you go to the files uh, section of the mod nexus uh, download page uh, I got the main, all right, and there is two other versions. He has the peak version, the potato version. I think uh, this is more of like if your computer is like mid-tier, it's really not, you know, running the game. You can try this one. If you just have a very old system, the potato version will help. But granted, it will change the look of the game. Uh, a lot of the textures things might look a bit muddy. On this main version, though, really not a difference that I can spot. Uh, except for the FPS increase. It's pretty awesome what he did. I think the only thing I've noticed, and I don't really understand how, but the interiors for buildings are a little bit brighter, which is not a bad thing, to be honest. Uh, but that's the only thing that I noticed. Um, anyway, if you want to hit Windows R, percent app data percent, that'll bring you to your roaming folder. You want to go back one, click on app data up here. You'll go to local instead. Uh, you'll scroll down, find stalker two. You'll go to saved and then config and windows. And within the main folder uh, zip that you downloaded from on Nexus, you'll have an engine.ini. You will drag and drop this into here. Uh, it's not going to replace a file because it's the file is not even in here by default. And that's it. That's how you install it. All right. We are back in the game. Uh, as you can see, I'm getting more FPS, 74, 73. Uh, everything looks basically the same. It's, it's pretty good. If I go to the base, we'll see I'm still, it still dips into the 50s. Uh, but now it's high 50s and it's not the 40s, so I'd say it's a pretty big increase. I'm still seeing 60 every now and then. Uh, so yeah, and I'll show you indoors. It definitely looks different. Um, you see it's a bit brighter. It can be a little bit odd, but I don't think it looks bad. I, I almost feel like the interiors are very dark by default anyway. Um, and here's my settings just so you can see. Probably should have showed this before, but um, I have it all cranked up decently high. Uh, I am running on DLSS quality, whereas I always had to use balance before. Um, I'm not using frame generation and everything's on a mixture of high and medium aside from texture quality, because this is really just based on your VRAM. If you have a lot of VRAM, you can actually run this on Epic. Anyway, that's the mod. Link will be in the description. Thank you guys for watching. Uh, probably won't have another stalker episode until they release a patch. I heard from a lot of different comments that I am very, very close to the part in the story where there is a soft lock. You know, I don't want to accidentally mess up my save. It's happened to uh, quite a few people now, and <laughs> I think I'd better off just waiting. Uh, I have some other things planned video wise, so we'll be fine. And uh, hopefully GSC will get that patch out really soon. It should be this week, but I think that's all I got for you guys. Thanks again. I hope this helps and I'll, I'll catch you in the next one. Peace out.